Hey everybody, so I recently did a bit of a drugstore haul, a bunch of drugstore makeup, and I thought I'd just share with you guys in case you were interested. I'm just gonna jump right in. The first thing I got is this Rimmel BB Cream. You guys know, I say this all the time, I love trying out new BB creams. I am reviewing this currently, it's what's on my face, so check out that video when it goes up. But this is the BB Cream Beauty Balm Matte 9-in-1 Skin Perfecting Makeup. They did have a matte version, a regular version, and a, like a luminous version. I decided to go with the matte because I feel like BB creams tend to get a bit shiny on their own anyways. So I wanted to see how this would hold up. So that's the first product I got. The next product I got is currently on my lips. This is from Revlon. It's a Color Burst Lacquer Balm. And the color I got is Ingenue. I didn't go to the drugstore planning to buy this close so you can see it but it just called out to me it's like it's a nude color and the lacquer bombs do have more of a shine to them I'll come in a bit so you can see so there's definitely a bit of a shine not a gloss but a shine and then when I swatch it out it's nude but it's more like a brownie nude more on the darker side and I don't know I just like the way it looks on my lips it looks like I'm not really wearing anything but it makes my lips look better than their natural color and I feel like it tones them down a bit like more fall like so I don't know so far I've been happy they're not drying at all so I've only had this when did I buy this stuff two or three days ago and I've tried it out all three days so there's a little bit of a review for you okay the next thing is this kit here this is from Physicians Formula. I used to buy this brand all the time as a teenager. Their powder, like their pressed powder and their bronzer, that's pretty much all I wore. So I haven't tried out this brand in a while. I saw this kit and I thought, why not? This is the Super CC Color Correction and Care Makeup Kit. And in it comes a concealer, a cream, and a powder. Let's just open it up. I already do plan to do a review on the CC cream to add to my BB cream collection of reviews here. I do have a playlist, but I thought I'd check out the other products. So let's start with the CC cream. That's what it looks like there. The color I have is light medium. I feel like this may be a tad too dark for me. I'm just gonna squeeze them out. Obviously I haven't tried this yet. Oh weird, a bunch of white stuff just came out. No, it won't be too dark. It's right here, you can't even see it. It is more on the pinkier side, however. So, I don't know if I'll like that, but I will try it out. And the next thing is their concealer. And it's, that's what it looks like. It looks like it's in one of those click up pens. Yeah, it's in one of those click up pens. I'm just gonna click it up for you. Okay, whoa, too much. <laughs> the concealer is definitely I think gonna be too dark for me. There it is there, this giant swatch. So much came out of the pen. There's the pen there. But I don't feel like that's gonna be very highlighting. Maybe I should have gotten just the light shade instead of the light medium. I don't know, if you guys wanna see a review on this, let me know. As well as this powder, if you wanna see a specific review on that, let me know. Okay, can I just say the packaging is adorable? It's probably not for everyone, but I don't know, I like that hologram and the pink and the white, it just, calls to me, it's so pretty, and the powder itself is multicolored, oh my goodness. Color overload. So, let's see what this powder looks like. When you swirl it all together, it just looks pretty light. Swatch it on my hand for you, wow. That's really light considering the cream products. It's right there. Very light considering that's the BB cream and that's the concealer, and then look at that powder. Maybe it's supposed to be more on the translucent side. This is the Super CC Color Correction and Care Powder Light Medium. That is definitely not light medium. I will still try it out. I'll probably try it out with the BB cream, actually. Maybe I'll try out all three. Let me know. If you guys want all three in a video, let me know. Okay, and the last product I got is from Maybelline. This is the new Master Precise by Eye Studio Ink Pen Eyeliner. My Stila eyeliner is running out. I've been trying out the hard candy one, trying to get it to work, but it, it's just, there's something not quite right about it. So I wanted to try out this one. It says it's new, it's probably new in Canada. You guys in the US have probably had this for a long time, but it looks like very similar to the Stila one. Should we swatch it? Hang on, I'll open the packaging. All right, that 
I mean, don't, don't look at my jagged line there, but that is very pigmented, very pigmented. There's the pen there, and it glided on really easily. So I'm going to try that out tomorrow with my eyeliner and see how it is with application. But yeah, that's pretty much it for my drugstore haul. I hope you guys enjoy, and thank you so much for watching. Bye!